Hey, how you doing? This is Keith Bryant, aka GQ Smooth, and today I'm doing a film on society. Um, basically, what I want to say is, when it comes to today's society, today's society is so corrupted, and it's, it's to me, I don't understand today's society um, because of where I'm from. You know, I'm an '80s baby, so. Um, it wasn't like this back in the day, like how today's society is when it comes to um, how today's society has been so brainwashed when it comes to our people, when it comes to our children. It's just so corrupted, so fucked up. And um, so basically what I'm here to say is, is that we need to do something about today's society. You know, the crime, killings, uh, the raping, the murdering, just we need to turn uh, negatives into a positive when it comes to, to today's society. Um, it's just so fucked up, it's real fucked up, and I think we need to do something about it as people, um, as the human race, no matter what color, the color doesn't matter. It's all about just the human race in general, what we need to do to make our neighborhoods more safe, our streets, and just the world in general. You know what I mean? Um, even when it comes to, um, you know, neighborhood watch programs, whatever we need to do to make our neighborhoods safe, we need to do it as a people. You know what I mean? Um, it's just so crazy and corrupted, like today's society. And you got people out here that's more focused on negatives than a positive. Um, people are so so focused on today's music, today's society. Um, it's, it's just people get some sort of feedback off of negativity instead of positivity. I don't quite understand that. Um, we need to get back to our communities. You know what I mean? Um, and start having old school block parties and uh, what we need to do to raise money to, 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 to uh, build more recreation centers and, and to get the drug dealers off the streets and the criminals off the streets and let's do something to uh, make our, our neighborhoods safe again. Um, keep our children safe again. You know what I mean? Because um, I'm sick of all the killings and the, the raping and the criminal activities and the criminalistic endeavors in this day and age that we live in today. We need to stop it, man. We need to do something about it. You know what I mean? Um, and I plan on doing something about it. You know what I mean? Um, whatever it takes when it comes to giving back, when it comes to neighborhood watch programs, when it comes to rounding up uh, a group of people so we can talk about what we need to do to make our neighborhoods and streets safe again, whatever we need to do. And what kills me about that, speaking on um, people, it kills me how, you know, when a person such as myself is talking about something positive within the world, you get a lot of criticism and, and, and negative feedback off of positivity. Even when it comes to <clears throat> someone speaking about positivity, you get a lot of criticism and feet in it negative feedback. I don't quite understand that. I thought that uh, positivity was a good thing. I thought that speaking positive was a good thing. It actually is a good thing, but when you got people that speaks, you know, negative about people that speaking positive, then it's something inside of them that they need to let go. And when I mean something inside of them, I mean there's a lot of evilness and negativity with, with inside that person or people. Um, but this is who I am. And I like being around people that's about positivity and love and tranquility and harmony. And that's what we need within this world itself. We need more of love, we need more of God, we need more of positivity uh, than negativity, you know what I mean? So we need that, we need that. Uh, it just kills me when it comes to people. You know, people, you know, they get some sort of feedback off of negativity. 
you know, in this in, in, in this uh, society, society that we live in today, you know, uh, I don't quite understand it. It's like I said, it wasn't like this back in the day. You know, I'm an 80s baby, which you would call the golden era. You know what I mean? Where it was nothing but, <clears throat> I mean, don't get me wrong, it was crime, but it was more, it was more positivity than negativity. It was more content back in the day. Nowadays, you know, you got black people don't know how to get along. Just the human race don't know how to get along. You got black people killing black people. You got police officers killing people. You got teachers committing crimes. You got people at stores, and restaurants. You just got people in general that's committing crimes. And, 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 and all about negativity instead of positivity. So I guess I'm doing this film. What inspired me to want to do this film called Society is just the way society has been brought up and brainwashed by people. You know what I mean? So whatever we need to do to make it safe when it comes to our streets, our neighborhoods, our children, and within the world itself, we need to do that. You know what I mean? So immerse yourself around more positive people than negative people. Because no matter what you do in life, you'll always have haters within the world. Especially when it comes to positive uh, things that you're wanting to do and positivity within itself. You can always have the devil, you can always have ne negativity, you know, um, um, out there. But you know what they say, when it comes to love, when it comes to God, God and love overrules evil and negativity any day. So I guess what I'm trying to say is, I think that we need more love and God um, uh, in this world that we live in today so we can overrule the devil and negativity and the evil trappings in this world and the evil doers out there in the world. So that's what we need. We need it quick, fast, and in a hurry. You know what I mean? Because uh, yeah, this world we live in today is just so chaotic and so fucked up in turmoil. It's like, you know, people don't want to do whatever it takes to, to, to save our planet, save our streets, and save our neighborhoods. But that's what we need. We need that. So, that's all I want to say today. This wasn't going to be a long um, uh, film, short film or whatever. So, um, But that's all I want to say today. And uh, my name is Keith Bryant, a.k.a. GQ Smooth. And I'm here to say peace, love, and harmony. God is love, and love is God. Always remember that. Peace. In the scar to my backside Communication was something we never had You were verbally abusive Calling me nigga we're mad And I can never understand why Although the pain would hurt I refused to let you see me cry And all I ever wanted was to be treated as an equal Need some common courtesy and respect around other people But you can't even give me that You can't get over the fact that I'm black So this is how you act You walk around rapping and raving and cursing Telling me I'm less than three-fifths of a person You don't think it hurts, but that's okay Whether I'm agreeing to force come June 19th I'm getting a divorce, emancipation, proclamation Let this message be heard all across the nation And maybe we can make a deal And give America some time so she can heal Because she definitely something worth fighting for Or maybe even dying for A me or more, so precious so we all adore But until then, I got a reminder of her sin So history would never repeat itself again America I'm thinking of you, even though it's hard to still love you I know we started this thing off on the wrong track to forgive it for all of that America, my home of liberty Where is the love and unity? Break this chain so I can be free So I can be all that I can be The nation is sick The world is all messed up Trouble is in the land Confusion all around Although it's been a struggle To get you to face up and admit to your blame I can see deep inside you really want to change And rightfully so 
So I forgive you for Brown versus Ward in 1954 I forgive you for all the fuss And how you used to beat us and make us ride in the back of the bus I can even keep it real and still feel That I can forgive you for what you did to Emmett Till And even though that it hurts, I forgive you for burning our church Despite taking our dreams and killing Martin Luther King I know America has a problem, she's not alone Despite the imperfections, there's not another place I can call home That's why she's something I deeply adore Something precious, something you and I should fight for But until then, I got a reminder of her sin so history will never repeat itself again America I'm thinking of you Even though it's hard, I still love you I know we started this thing up on the wrong track But I'm willing to forgive it for all of that America, my home of liberty Where is the love and unity? Break this chain so I can be free So I can be all that I can be